what is going on? Just got to the airport, actually flying out from Ohio um, to go to Genesis. I wanted to start documenting my trips to these events just to give you guys a little bit of a first-hand experience of what it's like to work in esports not as a player and just give you guys a taste of you know attending a big major or event i'm super excited for genesis in particular because you know we just signed five, four more smash players in addition to mvd jesse you know he's been here for a minute but we got Shattuck, Mutace, uh, Dark Wizzy, who's not going to be at this event, and Esam. So we have a squad and a half now. Um, I'm pretty hyped to, you know, be able to put together a team like that, especially because Smash was the first eSport I ever got. I got searched at TSA, but one of my bags did, because um, I had soap in it. So that was interesting, but it's all good. Can't stop winning. Uh, my coworker Roddy or Rodman, for those of you that know me, is actually coming to pick me up at the airport. Absolute doll for doing that. Okay, we just picked up the jerseys from the hotel I thought I was gonna stay at. Very, very hyped that we got the jerseys. <sighs> the night is just beginning because we have jerseys here. All right, it is the first day of Genesis and I am walking to the venue currently. And I gotta get there fast because I have to get um, Esam his jersey in time for um, his first match with MVD. Apparently they just said the line's really long though. So uh, it might be pretty scuffed there, we'll see. We are currently in the line to get in. It is crazy. I have moved maybe five steps in the past 30 minutes. We have finally made it in. Uh, we were in that line for a hot minute, guys. Time to find uh, the boys, see where they're at. The amount of people here, I've never seen anything like this. I've been to one other Smash Major. Um, Luminosity makes big moves in New York City this past January, but seeing Genesis is insane. I mean, come on, come on. Look at this guy. Cam, I'm gonna break your fancy new camera. Good morning, guys. It is Saturday, day two of Genesis, and today all of our players, as expected, have made it out of their pools, and they start playing in about two hours. Coffee acquired. Uh, got ourselves an ube uh, latte with two shots of espresso, because one is not gonna be enough for how hype I wanna be today. Okay, guys, it's safe. I was giving up on the dream of getting gum because I just thought it was not possible. But I thought, hmm, I'm gonna walk in the other hotels because mine didn't have gum, but usually I feel like they do. And look what we have here. Look what we have. Oh, that's not even gum. Oh no, I accidentally bought two. Okay, so I got here pretty early and there was no line, so it's pretty empty. Um, but I guess this is what a venue looks like at around like 9 a.m. What is up guys? Figurative here with Shattuck before his first match of day two of Genesis X. How are you feeling today? I'm um, feeling pretty good. Um, I wound up a bunch with like my other top players and I reviewed a bunch of bots with the people I want to play against. Uh, I played Latio Sayoshi and I'm pretty experienced in that matchup, especially because I've been playing it for years against like players in my region. So I feel pretty good. Do you think that matchup is Korin favored or? Yeah, I would, pretty, I would say like this plus one at best. If not like even, but probably plus one because of how it works, basically. Awesome. You've been attending tournaments for a long time. Are there any like nerves still when you play like at these or are you pretty much chilling now? I've been like working on my nerves a lot in the past like year. 
Uh, they're definitely like sometimes still there, but sometimes I've been really focusing on like trying to win. So like in my head, I don't have like space to think about like, oh, what if I lose, you know? So it's not as bad as before, but they're definitely like something still there. All right, guys. So our players are about to start playing finally. Shattuck and MVD. Um, and I wanted to give you guys a little bit more insight into the true glorious activities of being a manager in esports. So you got to make sure that everyone stays hydrated. And that means that you got to fill up the water. So I, I think I've, I've been trying to keep count. And I think one more fill up and we are past 10 water cups gotten for players um, across the weekend. What is up guys? We're going back to the venue now. Uh, it is almost four um, Pacific time and top 64 starts at six. So um, took some time to recharge all my devices um, get some food, and then uh, we'll be back at it pretty soon here. Uh, I'm pretty hyped. We have two players coming out on the winner's side um, and one in losers. So Shattuck and Mutes are in winners still. And then MVD came out with a clutch win over Cosmos in losers. So hopefully, hopefully we get something to top eight. That would be so sick and absolutely make my weekend. But let's get back after it. We're currently watching Shattuck's first set of winners top 64. Um, first game right now. It's pretty tight. Unfortunately, Mute just lost to Meister on stream. Uh, it was close. He could have brought it to the game five. It was like last stock, last hit situation. But unfortunately, I uh, did not end up going as well. So still have two players alive and losers. MVD won his first set 3-0. So happy with that. They could definitely make it happen. But hopefully, uh, you know, Shadow keeps on moving through winners because that would be a great help. Top 64 has been crazy. All three of our players are in losers now, which is sad, but we're still alive. Um, Esam didn't make it to top 64, but everyone else is still in losers. Uh, Shattuck just had a tough set against Tweak, and that sent him down to losers, but um, we're still living, and MVD's playing right behind me right now, so hopefully he clutches it out, keeps on moving on. There's a chance, actually, that Shattuck and MVD will have to play each other. Um, hopefully it does happen because uh, we want them at least as many as possible to get out um, and we want them to keep playing but sucks to that you might have a stride match eventually you got this here with Shattuck. He just top aided Genesis. How does it feel? Surreal. Like, I can't believe it's happening right now. Like, I beat people that I haven't beaten before. I beat the worst matchups of all time. Uh, I don't know, it's just so crazy. Um, yeah. You gotta play pretty early tomorrow. What's the plan for the rest of tonight? Like, how, uh, how, what are we doing? I'm gonna eat and I'm going to sleep. Maybe something in between, but that's basically it. Cause I need to rest, like, cause, yeah. I, I'm not trying to just lose immediately tomorrow. I gotta win. I actually gotta win the whole thing, actually. Cool. Yeah. Well, obviously, yeah, we're, we're, you don't have to. You're going no, to. I'm going to. Bro, I got mustard yeah, everywhere, but that hot dog was so fire. It was crazy. You put on tacos? I think I left my badge in the bag. Day three of Genesis, finals day. Shattuck is playing today in top eight. He plays against Neo, um, pretty cool dude. They play the same character. <clears throat> I think, obviously I'm biased, but our boy Shattuck gonna win it. It is going to be crazy, I, I'm so hyped. This is insane. I've been watching Smash since I've been in middle school. And the fact that um, I've been able to work on something that sent, um, well, we didn't do any. It's, it's all the players at the end of the day, right? But the fact that one of our players has made top eight of an event as prestigious as this is so crazy. Um, just to think about from my own perspective is like, I used to watch the Twitch streams of this, read like the Smash Reddit, like I'm that guy. So the fact that um, today one of our players is participating in top eight and I get a, a small part of that, um, is just crazy personally for me. 
It is going to be insane and I'm so happy for him because he's been working so hard and has deserved to get picked up long before I reached out to them through Twitter DMs. I'm honestly so happy um, that they chose to play for us um, because this kid is crazy and um, he's only just getting started, so um, awesome. Walk from off stage to the center feels like it's fucking forever. Like I remember, I remember my first time since top eight. I was like, oh, am I there yet? <laughs> Pronounce this word right now. Yes, <laughs> you, you, can, you can join the team. You can say this word right now. Yeah, five seconds. <laughs> Robert did beat. No, bro. Sorry, bro. <laughs> what do you know? No. How are you no. What are you? I don't, but I know it's not that. Like, congrats on top eight. Top eight is wrapped up. We did pretty good. Uh, not gonna complain, but we're just meeting up with some squad now. Take a quick picture, and then we're gonna get some dinner. A lot of us, so it should be pretty fun. The me brawler. The me balder. Mute. Slow to apply, so we came here to meet him, and he's literally money matching. We're playing games right now, and we're trying to eat. Oh no, how do you move this? Yeah, how do you pick it up? There, maybe press the, lift, the lever on the side. No, pull it up. Maybe? I dislocated the seat. What do you mean dislocated the seat? Like, like you can tip it. I'm zero. He like, we're both first dog. I'm zero. He's like 140. And I barely missed the kill. I read his double jump at a disadvantage, and I went over. Yeah, I went over. But he did double jump fair, and I swear, like, it, like you know moves that like alter your like high like fox fair type. I, he went lower than he showed up. I promise. I don't know why I'm clapping. We are back. If you can't tell by my voice, I am pretty tired right now. It has been such a long day and long weekend and pretty draining running around, filming all our players, um, cheering them on. And I got just so nervous at so many points for them. So I can't imagine even playing. But uh, honestly, I, I'm thinking now that I'm starting to go to more of these events that I, I might grind a little bit to try and play at one of these. Just, just for fun, not like expecting anything. What a crazy event and weekend. Um, if you told me like almost 10 years ago, 
um, when I saw my first Genesis. Um, when I was in middle school, that one day I'd get to, you know, support and work with the whole team um, and have one of our players make top eight and then get to experience that. Um, I would never believe it, but I mean, those guys are awesome, every single one of them. This was the first time for pretty much everyone other than MVD where I actually um, got to meet them in person. So um, it was super awesome to get to do that. It was amazing to get to meet so many different people and really um, experience what is prob probably um, the pinnacle, I guess, of all Smash events. So um, time to pack, I guess, time to pack. My plane's like actually boring right now, but thankfully there was like no line at TSA, so it was free. The only bad thing is it was one of like the old machines where you have to like take out your electronics. And I have like so much electronics from like controllers and all the random stuff I bring for for like events like these. And I, and I feel like such a, I'm just, I hate being that guy because I, I pulled out like 500 things, but we made it to the gate. So plane's about to take off.